All right, this is a tin can cuica. The cuica is a Brazilian percussion instrument. Uh, you might hear it in the, one of the, that real famous Beastie Boys song. You know, it's the sound that your straw makes when it's in the fountain. It goes wah, 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 up and down. Anyways, here is a soup can, an ordinary soup can. Remove the top lid. We got one of those fancy um, can openers that removes the lid without an edge. That's cool. If you don't have one, just make sure you take a, a file and file down that inside edge so you don't cut your hand. I've taken uh, this soup can and soaked off the label just by placing it in water for a couple hours and the label peels right off. These two cans right here, you can see they're white. I've painted them with just a basic white spray paint primer. <clears throat> that way I could decorate them if I want and do some artwork or whatever. Okay, here we go. So the first thing you do is you find your center of your can. You just take a quick measurement. You can even just eyeball this if you want. It doesn't have to be perfect. This one's two inches. I've already measured and marked this one and punched it. So we'll uh, do this one real quick. This one's three inches. So we'll do an inch and a half. And like I said, you know, just get a rough estimate. Kind of eyeball it. See where you're at. Got my center, and just take a punch. And just gently punch it through. Don't go too far. You don't want to make the hole too big. This is a bamboo skewer, an ordinary bamboo skewer. I got with an order of some Thai food. You might have some of that when you do some barbecue. It might be some shish kebabs or something. Alright, so you take the bamboo skewer, and you just Gently put it in the hole, point it in first, kind of wedge it in there, and you're going to make it nice and snug so the end of the bamboo skewer is sticking out the end of the can as such. And once you do and you pull it back out, you're going to have a little indentation, a little mark, and that's going to be your first guide. And I've already made one here. What you do is you take a piece of duct tape, and right underneath that mark, you take the duct tape and you start wrapping it around and wrapping it around in a circle and you start building up a little edge there, a little uh, edge of the duct tape. I've already done one here and you can see what it looks like. Now you take it once you put the duct tape on there and you put it in the hole, boom, and you wedge it up in there nice and snug. You can see now the point is sticking out the end of the tin can and it's nice in there snug. All right. Now you do the same thing on the other end, piece of duct tape. Just start wrapping it around there. Nice and snug. Cuica, like I said, is a Brazilian percussion instrument. Most famous in a lot of, well, a lot of Latin music, of course, but... You hear it in that Beastie Boys song. I can't remember the name of it now. I always forget. I always forget. Anyways, there's how we do that. You can see how that's wrapped on the other end. Now it's made nice and snug. What's going to happen is it's going to create a, vi a vibrating noise. You take an ordinary piece of cloth, old cloth from like a t-shirt, rip down a little section of it, get it wet. You have to get it wet, get it soaking in water, rinse it out. And then once you do that, you just rub the cloth gently up and down on the uh, bamboo skewer. You can apply pressure or no pressure and it makes a different noise, as well as you can muffle the top lid with the finger. And you've made yourself a cuica, a Brazilian percussion instrument called a cuica. Fuzz box instrument. Making music from trash. <laughs>